Eight signs of a spiritual attack. Only for God's chosen ones. Hey there, spiritual warriors. Have you ever felt like you're carrying an invisible weight on your shoulders, facing obstacles that seem to pile up out of nowhere? These could be signs that you're under a spiritual attack. Today, we're diving deep into the realm of spiritual warfare, uncovering the telltale signs that you're being targeted by unseen forces. But what exactly is a spiritual attack? Unlike the everyday challenges we all encounter, spiritual attacks are intense and overwhelming trials that go beyond the ordinary. They're not just random struggles. They're strategic disruptions aimed at testing and refining your spiritual resilience. In this video, we'll explore the subtle signs of spiritual attacks and equip you with the knowledge and tools to protect yourself against them. Have you ever felt like the harder you try to do the right thing, the more obstacles you face? You're not alone. Spiritual attacks often manifest as conflicts, barriers and confrontations orchestrated by the forces of darkness. But fear not, because as believers, we have the authority to overcome these attacks and emerge stronger than ever. So, if you're ready to arm yourself with spiritual discernment and resilience, join me as we uncover the signs of spiritual attacks and learn how to resist them. Remember, you're not alone in this battle. And with the right knowledge and faith, you can turn your trials into triumphs. Let's dive in and discover what God wants to reveal to you. Number one, diminished spiritual engagement. The devil often employs tactics to distance you from God by eroding your participation in spiritual practices like prayer, fasting, and evangelism. A dwindling interest in these activities should raise alarms, signaling the adversary's influence. During spiritual attacks, engaging in these practices may feel arduous, and connecting with the divine may seem elusive. The lack of motivation to pray, read scriptures, or meditate serves as an early indicator of spiritual assault, particularly if these rituals were once integral to your life. The adversary exploits these vulnerabilities, aiming to sever your connection with divine power and render you susceptible to attack. Feeling disinterested in spiritual pursuits is a ploy to disrupt your spiritual armor and leave you defenseless. Recognize this as a call to action. Despite the enemy's cunning, consistent prayer and immersion in scripture fortify your spirit and shield you from harm. Vigilance is key to repelling spiritual assaults. Maintaining spiritual nourishment through prayer, meditation, and scripture strengthens your resilience against the enemy's schemes. Number two, purposeful perplexity. Each person is bestowed with a unique purpose, the pinnacle of their spiritual journey, driven by passion as they pursue their destiny. Amid spiritual challenges, enthusiasm diminishes and purpose becomes obscured by the enemy's tactics, which aim to lead astray and instill doubt. Despite these trials, one must not succumb to deception but rely on their ordained purpose, resisting false paths that we can resolve. Trust in the clarity of divine purpose, seeking guidance through prayer and divine protection against distractions and doubt sown by the adversary. Through prayer, one can unveil their true purpose and withstand the assaults of the enemy, safeguarding their predestined path. Number three, emotional turmoil and mental strain. Feelings of oppression, confusion, and frustration often signal the onset of a spiritual attack, orchestrated to isolate you from divine guidance and render you defenseless. Amidst such assaults, you may grapple with intense stress and mental upheaval, leaving you overwhelmed and questioning your sanity. Past wounds resurface, stirring emotional turmoil and casting doubt on your resolve. These attacks aim to paralyze you, ensnaring you in a web of negative thinking and self-doubt. Resist the enemy's machinations, challenge every rebellious thought and reclaim control over your mind. Refuse to succumb to his illusions and manipulations. Instead, cultivate stillness through meditation, allowing divine guidance to fortify your spirit and embolden your resolve. Number four, surmounting obstacles. A telltale sign of spiritual assault is the sudden proliferation of obstacles, particularly in previously stable areas of your life. These obstacles manifest as inexplicable challenges in relationships, career setbacks, or unforeseen hurdles that impede your progress. Recognize these hurdles not as mere coincidences, but as deliberate tests 
designed to derail your spiritual journey. By acknowledging these challenges as manifestations of a spiritual attack, you empower yourself to confront them head-on, ensuring that your pursuit of divine purpose remains steadfast despite the adversities. Number 5. Unexplained Physical Afflictions Physical manifestations devoid of medical explanations serve as a clear indication of spiritual attack. These manifestations range from inexplicable fatigue and headaches to more severe symptoms like unexplained pain or disrupted sleep patterns. Such symptoms often coincide with periods of spiritual progress or impending life changes, disrupting both your spiritual and physical equilibrium. Recognizing these manifestations as signs of spiritual assault prompts a holistic approach to healing, wherein spiritual guidance complements medical intervention. By acknowledging the spiritual underpinnings of these afflictions, you equip yourself with the insights needed to effectively manage and overcome these unexpected physical challenges. Number 6. Financial Strain and Resource Depletion A sudden lack of financial resources can serve as a covert assault aimed at compromising your values or deterring you from your spiritual path. Such financial woes, whether arising unexpectedly or without apparent cause, can destabilize your ability to meet basic needs and maintain stability. When these setbacks coincide with pivotal moments of spiritual progress or divine calling, it transcend mere coincidence, suggesting a deliberate attempt to distract, stress, and instill doubt in your faith. Recognizing financial difficulties as potential spiritual attacks prompts a shift in approach towards resolution, empowering you to address these challenges with spiritual fortitude and resilience. Number 7. Resurgence of Past Habits The resurgence of old habits, particularly those you've diligently worked to overcome, signifies a subtle yet potent spiritual attack. This regression often occurs just when you've made significant strides in personal or spiritual growth. The sudden temptation to revert to familiar patterns, be it addiction, negative thinking, or destructive behaviors, serves as a strategic ploy to undermine your resolve and divert focus from your spiritual journey. Acknowledging this resurgence as a potential spiritual assault underscores the need for heightened vigilance and fortified spiritual practices to preserve hard-earned progress and propel you forward on your path. Number 8. Disturbing Dreams and Visions Disturbing dreams and visions occurring in vulnerable moments like sleep can signify spiritual attacks, aiming to instill fear and weaken spiritual resolve. Identifying these encounters as deliberate assaults emphasizes the need for protective practices before sleep. Engage in prayer or meditation to strengthen your mind and seek guidance from mentors to regain peace and clarity amidst such spiritual challenges. My friends, if you resonate with these signs in your spiritual journey, it's time to take action to reclaim your spiritual authority. Here's how you can do it. 1. Strengthen spiritual disciplines. Make prayer, fasting, and meditation consistent part of your spiritual routine. These practices fortify your spiritual armor, making you less susceptible to attacks. 2. Seek knowledge and understanding. Educate yourself on spiritual warfare. Understanding the enemy's tactics and the tools at your disposal is essential. Dive into scripture, spiritual literature, or attend workshops to deepen your understanding. 3. Cleanse your environment regularly. Clear your home and surroundings of negative energies. Use prayer, anointing, or purification rituals according to your beliefs to cleanse your space. In spiritual warfare, the enemy's strategy revolves around four main objectives. To discourage, distract, provoke discontent, and sow discord. Aiming to shake faith, divert focus with worldly temptations, breed dissatisfaction, and create division. Victory is attainable through following Jesus' example of withdrawing to pray, prioritizing communion with God. Regular, distraction-free prayer empowers believers to surrender their battles to God, serving as a potent weapon against spiritual attacks. Signs of spiritual battles include a decline in zeal, confusion in purpose, or frustration with circumstances. But believers possess the tools to combat these challenges through prayer, scripture, and meditation, which dismantle strongholds and disrupt the enemy's plans. In the journey of spiritual warfare, remember you are never alone. 
the spirit and universe have paved your path to triumph. If you appreciated these insights, show support by liking, commenting and subscribing for more empowering content. For deeper guidance and reclaiming your spiritual authority, explore the free book and consider a personal consultation linked below. Let's face these challenges united and emerge victorious. Peace and blessings to all.